Hello friends, welcome to Photoshop video tutorial series. In this video tutorial, we are going to discuss creating a new document in Photoshop. That means how do we create a new document in Photoshop. While designing graphics, setting up the new document correctly is one of the most important step. Because we know that Photoshop is a raster image editing software. And also we know that raster images are going to get pixelate when we start changing the resolution of the image. So images are resolution dependent, they get pixelate friends. So we should be very careful before creating the document only, we should define the size of the document properly, we should define the resolution of the document properly and also we should know to which media we are targeting the graphics. First of all, we need to understand is the file meant for a digital media or print media. As we know that Photoshop is used to design graphics for various domains, especially digital media and print media. Digital media like PC, mobile, tablets, web, TV, etc. Are you creating an image for these devices? If you are creating an image for these devices, that means you are targeting the digital media. If you are creating a graphics for newspaper, magazines, wall posters, books, brochures, photographs, then you are targeting the print media. That means you might be interested in creating a wallpaper for a PC or a mobile or you might be interested in creating a game environment, game characters or you might be interested in creating a web banner or web ad or you might be editing a video. That means you are targeting a digital media or you might be interested in creating some article for a newspaper or you might be interested in creating a cover page for magazines, books or you might be interested in creating a wall poster or a movie poster or you might be taking a photograph printout. That means you are targeting a print media. First, you need to understand this. Are you targeting the graphics to the digital media or print media because that help you to take decisions later while creating the new document. Photoshop provides some of the predefined set of common document sizes for various domains as well as it allows creating the document of required size. Of course, we can create a new document by selecting the predefined set of common documents or we can set up the document according to our requirement also. To create a new document in Photoshop, we have to go to the file menu, then click on the new command, you will get a new dialog box, then set up the requirements, then say ok, that's it. So what I do is I minimize the word document, I double click on Photoshop icon to launch it. You can see that the Photoshop got open. To create a new document, we have to go to the file menu, then click on new command. If you click on the new command, you get a new dialog box where you need to give various informations so that the Photoshop creates a new document according to the requirement. I close this window. Even you can use a shortcut key, Control N. Instead of going to the file, then clicking on the new command, if you just press Control N, you get this new window or a dialog box. And after that, you need to give the various information related to the new document. You need to tell what should be the width, height, resolution, color mode, background content and the name of new document. You can observe, first it is asking the name of the new document. Here you can give any name that you like. For example, if you are creating a game character, then you can give a name of the game character. Or you might be creating a visiting card, then simply you can say here visiting card. Any name you can give, that is going to be the name of the new document friends. And after that you can see here it is showing predefined sets of uh, sizes, document sizes in this list. I am going to discuss about it little bit later, okay. At present we are going to create a document according to our requirement. Okay. I want to create a background image for the game. Okay, So here I say background environment. That's going to be the name of the new document. And then we can mention the width and height. So give width, I am going to say here 1024. And here you can select the measurement unit. As we are targeting digital media, we have to select pixels. If you are targeting graphics for print media, then we use inches. If we are targeting the graphics for the digital media, we use the measurement unit pixels here. So as I am targeting the background environment image for the game, I am especially targeting it for the digital media. Hence, I select here pixels. Similarly, I want the height of the image also 1024 pixels. Okay, I am selecting the pixels not inches. Then we should set the resolution. For digital media, the default resolution is 72. So people prefer using the resolution 72 which is good. You can give more or less also. So resolution indicates pixel per inch. In one inch, how many pixels you want to fit. 
that's the meaning of resolution so 72 pixels per inch is a default resolution for digital images whereas 300 pixels per inch is the default resolution for the print media so at present as i am targeting for the digital media i give here 72 next thing we have to give here the color mode for the digital media we have to choose the color mode rgb if it is a print media then we choose the cmyk okay at present i am selecting rgb the next we have to set the bit depth 8 bit depth is the common whereas 16 bit as well as 32 bit are a high definition images if you are targeting you can select these two at present i put it 8 bit similarly the background content indicates the background content should be uh, what so here i am selecting the white background color i want even we can set the various informations i discuss about these things in detail step by step so white and then the color profile we are setting srgb which is a default uh, color profile and uh, pixel aspect ratio is a square pixels of course uh, if you are not targeting for high end uh, digital graphics then you should use the square pixels if you are targeting for high end digital images then you have to target for uh, or select the other pixel aspect ratio so square pixels is the default that is how we set up a new document friend and then once i click on ok photoshop is going to create a new document which is going to have 1024 by 1024 image and here it is showing the ruler is showing in inches actually i right click on the ruler and click on pixels to show the ruler units in pixels and also you can see that the image has one layer called as background layer okay as we know that every image is going to have at least one background layer that is how you create a new document friends you need to decide to which uh, media you are targeting hope you guys have understood at least how to create a new document in the next video tutorial i am going to discuss in detail about this window each and every component we understand clearly okay so for this tutorial this much is enough friends for more benefits and be updated please subscribe to my youtube channel and don't forget to like comment and share these videos with others so that everyone will get benefited keep learning keep coding keep sharing thank you guys thank you very much see you in the next tutorial